They provide the user with insight into the problem. The following works make use of such messages, transforming the constructs from the digital realm to an analog domain. This portfolio of prints is the result of collaboration with Australian internet artist Mary Ann Brees, also known as Mez. 204 No Content means that the server has received the request, but there is no information to send back. Typographic images with error reports are silk screened over offset prints found in 1990 in the trash of a printing house. These found prints are the first trial prints of a calendar published for a Franciscan monastery in 1991. It consists of pictures with religious motifs and reproductions from their contemporary art collection. Each of the found sheets carries a different image, a kind of random print. 204. No content. 205. Reset content. 206. Partial content. Mez is the inventor of her own language, Mez Angel, a mix of English and programming languages, where the visual appearance of written words and the reader's interpretations of them play an important role. In the Fax.nl project, a series of fax actions were made, each considering a different part of the Netherlands' fine arts and related bureaucratic network. A computer placed at a chosen site performed a pre-programmed fax modem communication to chosen fax addresses taken from a database. Each database was compiled from several sources. The locations are an integral part of the project and from where and to whom the message is sent is very important. The fax message consists of several A4 pages bearing a typographic image that reads a chosen internet error message. In the first project, 404 file not found faxes were sent from an artist's run space to 217 fine art organisations, institutes and foundations. In the second project, 406 not acceptable faxes were sent from an artist society to 431 galleries. In the third project, 415 unsupported media type faxes were sent from a cultural center and were received by a total of 118 museums. In the fourth and final project, 204 No Content, a fax was sent from one artist's studio to another. In contrast to the spam model, this one-to-one, -one, one-way fax action took place at Darko Fritz's studio and at the studio of his colleague, an artist in residence at PS1 New York. Each fax communication took between three and six minutes, depending on the data transfer speed. Some actions in total took as long as two days. All the computer graphics from this project are free of charge and copyleft. With no copyright claimed on the work, it can be reproduced in any analogue or digital form. There's a possibility to download, fax, print and copy the graphics from the website as well. Fax recipients can send their feedback by both fax and email to a noted address, the respectably anonymous information departments of the institutions from where the fax is sent. With the first action, which took place with 217 organisations, only two representatives called by telephone to confirm whether or not the received message was part of an application. Gallery representatives reacted predominantly with negativity to the computer graphics given to them as a gift. By the way, thermostatic fax printers don't use ink at all, but heated fax paper. On the other hand, if the fax was received by a computer, the user could choose to print the document or not. 
After the third action, museum representatives reacted mostly with positive curiosity. A 25-metre-long flower installation was set up in the very centre of the city of Zedar. This site contains ancient urban history dating from Roman times when it was a forum, a place of exchange for political and other civil ideas. The site has hosted archaeological digs from Roman times, Romanic and Baroque churches, and parking lots alongside other urban elements. One hundred. Continue. I am still alive. One hundred and one. Switching protocols. I am still alive. Two hundred. Okay. I am still alive. Two hundred and one. Five hundred and five. HTTP version not supported. I am still alive.